have I got a video for you. So, don't get me wrong, it's January. It's a mild January, but what we do for birthdays, have a big social with the boys. Get everybody together, as many as you can, can get them booked off work or whatever. Luckily this time it was my 30th, so the wife had booked me on Millbrook Fisheries down in Staffordshire, and I tell you what, for a carp fishery, it's amazing. It's got a stock of 200 carp, up to 39 pound, and then only four and a half acres lake. It's one of the best stocks you'll, you'll find, especially in the Midlands, for, for the size lake it is kind of thing. And we expect it to be a nice hard trip, but it didn't work out that way at all. It was, it was a minter. So when you get there, you have a walk around, you have a look at your pegs. And then all, everybody goes into a peg drawer. Ball out of a hat to pick your pegs. Luckily for me, my birthday, I didn't have to do that. Nice. I got the first draw. <laughs> nice. So we get there, not a massive lot happened in the morning, everybody's a bit sceptical, rods were flying in everywhere, so the fish were a bit spooked. But it didn't take long really, poor Lloyd, he has a take, and yeah, this is what happened. Okay, Lloyd. <laughs> you're, you're okay, Lloyd. What's happened, mate? Like, bro, I was literally right. I've literally just been talking to Egg, saying, I don't know about rigs you now, like, I always used to say the thing again and again because it's what confidence in. I was like, like hybrid leg clip. I've got absolutely 100% faith. Don't need to use helicopter rig because the leg comes off. <laughs> <laughs> Eggs are such about eight foot off the bank, wasn't it? It wasn't far out, no. It wasn't far off the bank, no. To be fair, I've had a lot of liners on that rod. All day I've been getting liners. And if I'm being honest, it didn't fucking feel that big of a fish anyway. But, that's not the point, is it? Oh, turn that off. So after that poor son had lost his fish, not, not a lot happened, nothing nothing really happened. There was no shows, there was no fizzing. The wind was picking up, it was hacking down into peg one where I was. Then, out of nowhere, nobody expected this guy to have a fish, Mr. Damien Martindale. He goes and has a bite. I'm here, Damien. I caught a fish. That is a surprise. I do. I don't know how to put the flash on. First fish for me. Uh, is that recorded? Yeah. Just be friendly, oh, come on. Trying. First fish for me on my birthday social. I'm last. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably be last. I wasn't actually expecting it to go off, and uh, we, it we were literally just sitting there and saying it'd be nice if you got one. Yeah, I did. I was. I was literally just and sitting just there saying it. it'd be nice, and there you go. It rattled off. Happy days. Now the the, the dark nights have rolled in. We're, we're, we're all sitting, having a social. It was going to happen. Mr. Lee's rod. Rod was away. Always going to happen. Is that me, Lee? Whew. Shaking. Craig, what was my prediction? What did I say earlier on? What did I say? If I'm going to have a bite, what's it going to be? Hey, what did I say it was going to be? Do you remember? No. I predicted a common. Did you? Not for me, did not it? Was it not you? No. Must have been David then. <laughs> all right, my bad. Oh, he was going nowhere. Twenty-five-two. Nice. Nice. I want my phone. I need a nice lot of to start. Twenty-five pound two ounces. See, yeah, first night. Still got another full day and a night ahead. So hopefully, plenty more where this come from. <laughs> Happy days. Everybody goes to bed at this point. It's dark. It's cold. Nobody wants to sit out in the wind. Wind ridiculous. Get a phone call. Of course it's Mr. Lee Dad again. Got another one in the net. Come come over, come do some filming. Potter off over into the wind. Not till enough use these balls, Bridge. Huh? Not till enough use one of these balls. Do the honors if you can, bro. 2311. 2311? Nice. Yeah man. Make it as quick as you possibly can. 23.11 at the scaly 
January breeze ice block, not breeze block, ice block. Absolutely freezing. Went off like a steam train. Thought it was going to do me wrong the island at one point. It went a bit solid, but didn't really know what happened. But <laughs> still went to the net either way. I'd talk a bit more, but I'm freezing. <laughs> it's it's late now. I'm I'm knackered. I'm I'm staying in bed. Gets another phone call. Of course, it's Lee again with his third fish. I wasn't getting out of bed for this one. There's no footage of this one. I think there may be a video knocking about of it uh, being put back, but yeah. I wasn't getting out of bed, the winds were 40 mile an hour, it was ridiculous. So at this point, it's not going well for me, my bibby is not staying where I want it to. Oh, what a night I've had. Jesus Christ. It's half six now, I've just had ring Craig. <laughs> I've looked up, felt something hit me on the head. What's that? Looked up and just see Sky, just managed to grab the bibby as it was going. Just haven't managed to get the pegs in properly, have I? Still no fish though, not doing well. Well he's had three, but this wind, I don't know whether they're gonna get on it or not. Massive southwesterly wind, I mean massive. Pressure's gonna be dropping. I don't know whether to stay in the teeth of this, brave it out or move. God, it's uh, it's rough, it's definitely rough. The next morning comes, everything, everything calmed down then. The winds calmed down, the sun come out. It was, it was a nice day. Lloyd had to take. He's buzzing now, he's playing this fish. Only guess what goes and happens to him again. See where the sun's beaming in peg three? Yeah. I've just put I've just redone that one and I was just gonna redo this one as well, bring it off the corner of the island a bit, because I wasn't that happy with it like. Has that just come off? <sighs> Has that just come off? Hey man. I've fished German rigs with soaked bottom baits and it goes in the mouth and it gets them so it's just unfortunate that I've lost them too really because I mean that just sits like a wafter anyway you know what I mean so as I'm walking back from from Lloyd's misfortune of the second loss it gets me baby I think yeah I'll have a sit down before I go for social no sooner has my bottom touched that bed chair I've had one beep and uh, the bobbins hit the blank. I've looked at it, it's like, it's held up tight, no more beeps, nothing, it's just sat there. I just watched the tip. Ooh, so I'll, I'll go on then, straight into that. Well, hey, finally off the mark here, 24 pound turn. Still got plenty of time to go. Very lively. Time to get him back and uh, get some more. Not much of a fight to it really, plodded around, I thought it was going to be bigger than it was. Slow, bomb. come up, yeah, lovely one. No sooner had we got that fish from mine back, Bridgie and Lee walked back round to theirs, Bridgie's upped into one. Get it! Thirty-one two. <laughs> nice. 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 First fish. Melbrook. Thirty pounder. Thirty pounder. First fish. First fish of the year. First fish of the year. Yeah. Can't complain. You know what type of year it's going to be. Good year, mate. Decent one, eight. Why is that thick? There is something I want to do. Well, I'm going to do a free giveaway. As soon as I reach 500 subscribers, I'll announce the free giveaway and it's going to go to one of the subscribers. So don't forget. What a crack, cracking fish for Bridgie, 31 pounds. You, you can't complain on that, but true Bridgie fashion, won't take anything under 30 pound anyway. But yeah, it's back onto Lloyd's turn. And finally for him, he actually managed to get one in the back of the net. Stopped him being a bit of a mod, I suppose. Yeah, really well, lost one yesterday and I lost one earlier. But oh, 27.5 Millbrook Merry. Well tougher than made up man. After two losing two. What more can you ask for? 
That's my favourite bit. Oh, the boys. Oh, that's my favourite bit. Not when they fall off. It all went, uh, all went a bit quiet after that. Not a lot happened. I think I got woken up in the morning by a couple of beeps. Nothing. I ended up getting out of bed anyway. Walked around to a couple of lads. I said, anybody had anything like? Expecting somebody to rang me to go and uh, video. Turns out Lloyd had only gone and had a 31. No video footage of that one either because I don't know what his problem was. True Lloyd fashion. It's getting to the end of the session now. Proper last doors. One person left to catch and that's Mr. Sam Brook. He hasn't caught on film before, but what a special one for him. What a special one for him. Proper last knockings off his rod rips. Whew. I am not made for running. <laughs> that is 28 on the nose. On the nose. Yeah! Get it! <laughs> <laughs> Good Get it. Yeah, I can see you. It's the first one. Yeah. Yeah. PB at the end of the session. Gives a speech. Gives a speech. 28 pounder. Long awaited PB in the UK. Yeah, yeah. 14. Go on. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> That's cold. That's nice. Couldn't have had a better session, could we? That's <laughs> Look at the state of him. Absolutely drenched, man. Can't believe they were missed. They had to stay in there, don't they? Hey, yeah, the Charles don't look any different. Oh, God, I'm th th thumbnail. Buzzing, mate. <laughs> Buzzing. <laughs> Get in. <laughs> and the little pigs lived happily ever after at the end. That's it. What a session that was. But there'll definitely more to come.